Hello everyone welcome to my video. In this video I will be explaining the life cycle assessment for the part 1. There are a few content in this video which including the definition and limitation in LCA, life cycle of a product, functional unit, LCA is system analysis, LCA and operational input output analysis, gate to gate. Let's get started with the first part which is definition of LCA so what is the LCA? Equals life cycle is about studies the environmental aspects and potential impacts throughout a product's life, i.e. cradle to grave, from raw material acquisition through production us, and disposal. Limitation is when the exclusion of economical and social factors distinguishes LCA from product line analysis, PLA, and similar methods. This separation was made to avoid a method overload, being well aware that a decision, for example, in the development of sustainable products, cannot and must not neglect these factors. Next, life cycle of a product. First, extraction of raw material including energy carrier second production of intermediate product third production of end product next use phase and the lastly end of life disposal or recycling Functional unit. The functional unit is most frequently defined as the provision of 1000 L liquid in a way to fulfill the technical aspects of the performance. This function can, for instance, be mapped with different packaging specifications. The following examples are arbitrarily chosen. Thus, for a comparison of packaging systems, the life cycle of 5000 pouches 2,000 reusable glass bottles, 1,000 cardboards and 500 2L PET bottles, which are four product systems that roughly fulfill the same function, needs to be analyzed and compared. Life cycle assessment as a system analysis. Life cycle assessment is based on simplified system analysis. The simplification consists of an extensive linearization. System analysis and the meaningful selection and definition of system boundaries are therefore important and labor-intensive tasks within every life cycle assessment. LCA and operational input-output analysis, gate to gate. There is always a risk of problem shift when system boundaries that are too restrictive have been chosen. This is often the case when only operational input-output analyses have been conducted. Frequently misused terms or eco-balance of the enterprise, corporate LCA or eco-balance without additional explanation. Next, I will tell you the history of early LCA's environmental policy background, energy analysis, the 1980s, the role of SETAC, the SETAC triangle in LCA guidelines. nineteen eighties the product related environmental analysis is complemented by the investigation of social aspect saw and economical aspect ea of the product system pla equals na plus lca plus saw plus ea with lca equals inventory plus environmental impact assessment nineteen nineties the role of setac in nineteen ninety a workshop was organized by SETAC in Smuggler's Notch, Vermont, on a technical framework for life cycle assessment. The famous LCA triangle was conceptualized, and later persiflage as, Holy Triangle. 1880s, Early LCAs. The new methodology was first applied to compare beverage packaging. 
1970s. Environmental policy background. The development of LCA start because. First, rising waste problems, therefore, studies on packaging, second, bottlenecks in energy supply and acknowledgement of limited resources. 1980s, energy analysis, energy political background, it is not surprising that, from the theoretical side, energy analysis or process chain analysis, by way of political solutions to the oil crisis in the 1980s, the SETAC triangle in LCA guidelines. Question and answer. Thank you for watching.